This is the Franchise Thunder Report, presented by Massengale Eye Care, Oklahoma City's leading eye care provider since 1989. Call 631-2020. It is game day, Thunder fans, and we've got you covered here on the franchise. Our pregame begins in Lower Bricktown at Heyday at 6 o'clock tonight, and we continue with our postgame immediately following the final buzzer back at Heyday. More information on that at the end of this report. Today, the Thunder shot around, and we get a chance to talk with Russell Westbrook and Steven Adams. Russ will talk about the excitement and intensity of a first game compared to others. You can probably guess his answer. Steven Adams addresses going up against Ennis Cantor. It's all coming up next on the franchise thunder report to do what you guys got to do tonight what are your top priorities as a team uh defend man you know that's gonna be the main focus all season long uh, just defend at a high level when we do that we put ourselves in position to be able to score the basketball at a high level so anything that you guys besides defending will have to do specifically against this team against the knicks uh, i mean they got a lot of shooters a lot of guys different guys different team um kind of like ourselves just got to be ready to play most of us are usually pretty focused on the game, but uh, now you got Ennis Cannon coming back tonight. What was it like having him on the team, and what's it going to be like seeing him again? I was great. It was great. Have you had a chance to speak with Ennis since he's been back to Oklahoma City or this morning? No. Russ, the first games excite you like they do fans. They mean anything more to you? I know they're off one of 82, but how do you view a first game? I like I view all the other ones, honestly. Uh, you know. I play the same way every time, every night, uh, regardless of the first game or last game. So for me, it's the same thing. How exciting is it just to get it going again? I mean, it's definitely exciting to get back playing. Um, but I was excited when training camp started. So. Uh, how about we? <laughs> rumble, rumble. <laughs> uh, keys for tonight against this uh, this opponent. Uh, the keys. Well, first is just transition D. Um, just getting back is quick as we can getting our defense set up and then it'll pretty much be down to our communication uh, for their sets. They have, uh, I'm not going to go into sets because it's boring, but it basically just comes down to how disciplined we are and um, how much awareness we have of the situations that we have to switch on or whatever, you know. So those are the two main things, mate. Steven Ennis has already put it out there that he's said you told him you're going to elbow him before the jump ball. Can you <laughs> confirm or deny this report? Uh, Next question, please. <laughs> what will it be like, playing, be like playing against Dennis? Well, there you go. Stole your question, mate. Uh, yeah. Uh, what'd you say, mate? What would it be like playing against Dennis? What would it be like? Competitively, we've got to win. I mean, it'll be the same. Yeah, same as same as normal. Again, it's different. Like, you know, a lot of this happens a lot. So players have relationships off off the court, yeah. But like on the court, it's just like a whole different thing. There might be a little bit of banter here and there, but other than that, mate, it's just yeah, normal stuff. <laughs> You feel like you're gonna have an edge in trash talk because <laughs> I'm trying again. Do you feel yeah. like you're gonna have an edge in trash talk because you kind of know him a little better? Yeah, I, I don't trash talk because uh, I, again, I'm not, I'm not good at trash talking at all. I'm really bad oh, at sorry, it. Oh, so are you for Ennis's trash talk? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, it's I've heard it all before, mate. We've already rinsed each other enough, so like I've heard it all before. He's got nothing new. <laughs> All right, that'll do it for this edition of the Franchise Thunder Report. Don't forget, we start in Lower Bricktown at Heyday tonight at 6 o'clock for our pregame. Desmond Mason, Andrew Gilman joining me for all you need to know about tonight's game against the Knicks. And then following the game, immediately following the final buzzer, Jerry Ramsey, John Hamm, and Matt Ravis will be on the air with our Franchise Thunder postgame show. We'll take your calls as well. Thanks for watching this edition of the Franchise Thunder Report. I'm David Garrett for Oklahoma's New Sound for Sports, 1077 The Franchise Oklahoma City, 1079 The Franchise Tulsa.